What's up, you guys? Welcome back to another unboxing. Just as fast, just like that, package came through. Woke up in a good ass mood today. Was feeling it. It's cloudy, it's foggy. Then it stopped me. I just, I don't know, man. I just woke up with good ass attitude, mood. Felt like it was gonna be a blessing day. I'm ready for 2020, ready for a good change. My appearance, most likely. And with a good ass mood, you're gonna have good ass music. For that, Brenton Woods in the background. Love him. Love my old school music. I'm real fan of that. That's why it's today's uh, hip hop CD album is his 18 best. I do not have the case for this. There is my Windex bottle, which I do clean my windows. Cleaned them yesterday. That's what I have. Uh, sadly, I do have the CD case for it, so that sucks. But uh, this is some good music. I highly, highly recommend him. My favorite song out of all these albums will be the one I'm playing, which is uh, I Like the Way You Love Me. Great song, great song. Uh, also love Darling. Darling's a good song. And baby, baby, you got you got it. It's another great song. Too. There's so many songs like I could go on and on about him, but he is a great, great artist. Uh, let's jump right into the unboxing. So I have two today to unbox, which is nice. I was only supposed to receive one. The other one's supposed to come tomorrow. So I was kind of excited about that one. <clears throat> when I woke up this morning in a good ass mood. I was like, yeah, I'm going to get my package today. Oh, yeah, that's good. Let me check. Went on eBay. All right, yeah, coming on time. Nice. Check the other package. Coming early. Expected delivery today. And that made me in a better ass mood, too. I don't know, something in my sleep, man. I had a nice dream. Everything, man. Ah, oh, man, it, it was nice. So what I do love... What the guy did was he did put a uh, tape fragile everywhere before I opened it. So that was kind of cool of him to, you know, do a little something like that, a little special. I will try to upload both of these on Monday. Uh, hopefully I don't forget one or the other. Oh, a box within the box, I think. So this one has, I don't even you see that, a little fucking popcorn bullshit, which I don't like. I'm going to put them in my bed here for now. Well, at least some of them. I don't want to make a mess in here. I'm in my room this weekend, so made it all nice and clean. Okay. So let me try to pull the box out if I can. Hope you guys had an amazing weekend this uh, weekend. Was it the greatest here where I was at? It was raining on Sunday, but Saturday was good. I had a free mesh time. Nice time. Oh, come on, man. Oh, okay, I see. Oh, yeah, I, I do remember now. It came with the box. It came with the box. It had a little extra protection on top. Uh, he added a uh, Patriots tape, which is easy to remove. So that's good. So just basically has his bow wrap. And then he's got his little car, uh, cardboard box. But just basically just for the sides. Look at that, look at that. You guys can probably see right now what it is. I know what it is. Super excited. Was debating on getting it for the longest time. But luckily for Christmas, 
sister hooked it up with the eBay card, and I was like, fuck it. Let's get it. This was a total, I believe it was 70 bucks. Uh, plus the gift card that I had she given me, so it was less. I think it ended up being like 40 bucks on the total, 45 what I paid for. So it's kind of cool that it has the box. I'll take it. Uh, it is not in new condition. Well, technically he said it is. <laughs> Just that it's missing a mirror. Which does suck. Let me get that nice shot in case I need that. In case I need that thumbnail. He did add Pinterest tape inside. <laughs> All right, so that's the box. That's the back part of it. This is the 118 scale version. It is kind of hard to find at a good price. These are usually overpriced. There was one I almost bought that was uh, all the way in Europe, I think it was. It was like 60 bucks with like 30 in shipping. I was like, God damn, 30? Did I do this right? Yeah. <laughs> okay, the top part of the box. Some sort of paint, which I'm not liking. <laughs> I am not keeping it in the box. I got all display case for it already. I will be definitely putting it in there. Oh, uh, the box is broken anyways. There's more paint and tape right here. So you can pull this out. Oh, there's some stuff at the bottom. Let me see what the hell that thing is at the bottom. Put this aside for now before we do the Full checkup. Okay, let's pin the tape. What is this? So the box is now empty. Oh, nice. <laughs> I don't have any of this. This is cool that I have now. This is uh, like a little manual that comes with it. How to disassemble, how to assemble, put everything back. That's kind of cool. I don't have this. I will definitely be preserving this. That's nice. Uh, so this is it. This is what it looks like. I am blown away. I'm already shocked. He did put painter's tape on the doors and the hood, which is smart. So they don't open up during transportation, which uh, is a smart thing from the seller. Here's another one on this one. There we go. Oh, this freaking ad keeps bothering me, so I'm about to skip that ad. I'm not getting paid for it, so why well, keep it? Oh, come on, dude. Just... All right, we got all the painter staple off, which is good. Now let's take a deeper look into this. This is a Mazda RX-7 by J Toys, 118 scale. Love, love this. Love their import racer series. As you can see, there's the hood. The front end part, the hood. So you can open this up. There we go. That's what the inside looks like. What I do like about this 118 scale, both doors open, sadly on one side only. But hey, can't complain. They did a fantastic job on the detailing. Hard to see the inside.
Uh, another thing that does open here. The truck. That's the back part. The truck. Once I got you back, I never let you go again. Uh, this side only one door opens. Oh wait! Oh, never mind. Oh right! I'm... Shit! Both sides open. Look at that. That is crazy. I am in shock right now, man. Blown away. Like I said before, one mirror is missing, so I'm trying to find somebody that could sell me a cheap, broken car. With the same exact mirrors, or maybe just find a mirror itself and replace it. So we'll see. It is uh, so far the condition of it, not too bad. A lot of dust. I do see. Oh, I do see a scratch. I don't know that scratch, or just give me paint, or I don't know what that is. I need to pick that up. So, uh, oh, there's another one right here in the hood as well. So we're gonna try to either remove that or now that looks like to be like. Oh, that's that. No, I, I got our way off. That is that was uh, tape residue. Uh, this came in the display stand, as you can see. Mazda RX8. Bottom is basically just showed the screws, the original tape, I believe, is still there. I won't be keeping it here since the display, since the display uh, shelf that I have these on doesn't fit this whole thing, only fits the car perfectly. So, you know, I want to keep it there because it has a whole light. I can put the light. Pretty badass. Uh, so they can come out even better uh, if you like this video make sure you hit the like button subscribe if you're new more import tuner daily toys coming through uh, I collect all kinds of die casts anything that's all the way from a uh, low rider all the way down to a tuner to a dump city car and that's about it if you like that kind of stuff so make sure Subscribe. <coughs> Go check out my other videos, man. More shit like this. You'll see. You guys on the next. Choking over here. I'm a brat.